maybe pace yourself a bit because it is um, it is shocking in a way and and everybody wants to know what you think and what you write and how you do it and all that kind of stuff um, but mostly I would say to enjoy it because um, I can actually see that my life pivoted you know there is sort of before the Alma and after the Alma and um, it was one of the most important moments of my career if not the most uh, important well uh, I did stop writing for a couple of years afterwards I think because in a way even a good shock is a shock and I had written seven novels in 14 years and I think the Alma was almost like the pinnacle of that and I, 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 I almost needed a rest I needed to stand back and to think about writing and about my career and all that kind of stuff so um, I, I'll tell you, I mean, one thing it did do was it allowed me to think of myself in a, in a serious way that I hadn't really been able to think about myself before. Well, the Alma year itself was absolutely amazing. I mean, I, I w was trying very, very hard to prove myself a worthy winner. Um, but in the meantime, I met what I sort of consider to be my kind of Swedish family now. And so whenever I come back to Stockholm, I have so many lovely friends who uh, I've met through that year. And I do, I keep hinting that I want a Swedish passport. And, and everyone goes, oh, ha, ha, yes, of course, we can arrange that. And that never shows up. So I'm still waiting for my Swedish passport. <laughs>